So Marvel TV is looking to cast some interesting characters. The one pretty much everybody's landed on is the possibility of Echo. So mm -hmm. uh, Echo is a Daredevil character, Daredevil-related character. Her story is deeply entwined with like The Hand and Kingpin. Um, I was just recently, like I started rereading Daredevil post Frank Miller. And I literally like passed her issue just like days before mm -hmm. that news kind of hit. So I was like, oh, that's kind of nice because I actually like I'm like just literally read it. So I'd be excited if this character does make it to like live action because I think there's something really cool with that character, I, you know, and I don't know if they would change many aspects of it. I, I assume you probably get rid of the hand connection because I mean, you don't have to get rid of the hand connection. You, you don't, but do you want to be like, th this was explained in Iron Fist. Oh. I mean, it was, it was explained in Daredevil, so it's fine. Oh, that too, yeah. yeah. I'm all, not as much as Iron Fist, but yeah. Uh... It's true, but hey, you haven't got to acknowledge that. You just brush it off. They definitely won't acknowledge that. <laughs> no. But that's, this is my question. Is this setting up Daredevil? Or... Is this just a tie-in to Hawkeye because she was the original Ronin? Um, because I think that the people are trying to say this is casting for a lead in their own in their own TV shows. I know it's not. It's it's a lead in a TV show. Right. That's exactly what it is. Yeah. I think it's clearly Hawkeye, given the the, the date it's set for filming. Uh, yes, yeah, when Hawkeye's supposed to start. So. Mm. Oh. Which should make sense. You can have her in the flashbacks. And then that, you could bring her in later on. That is true. Um, I, I wouldn't mind it if maybe it's uh, multiple things. Like if Hawkeye starts filming and the Daredevil thing eases up, maybe you explain it with a, with a flashback. You add in Daredevil yeah. to the MCU property. You're like, oh, she has connections to that character. Yeah, some time has went on for Daredevil. He's had connections with this character. So you can sort of have your cake and eat it too, if you will, with that one. I say the, the way things are going, we can absolutely put Daredevil in anything before stuff starts production. Exactly. So <laughs> you want Daredevil and Spider-Man through the lawyer? Cool, you can have him in there. You want right. machine hope Cool, you can have him in there. In Hawkeye? Cool, you can have him in there. You I could literally know. have him anywhere by the time they're back in production because he'll be yeah, free. Yeah. Like, so, like yeah. all of them will. So um, I, I would realistically, I, I wouldn't mind it if they do play her as you know, the Ronin that he mm -hmm. kind of gets it from and then maybe establish some history there with the hand. Uh, I mean, the hand does, you know, with Electra originate and have some play that you can do throughout Europe and the ancient <clears throat> history. So you could say that literally the part she comes from is what a different section of the hand like you, you can yeah. skew it enough so it's like oh that's why they never mentioned it it's like and nobody would i think care or complain so i i think it could work like I, there's possibilities to make this work easily and explain where the character has been now on the offhand that maybe they're casting somebody else they definitely aren't it's definitely echo though who else could it be <laughs> I, <laughs> I haven't got a clue who else it could be if it isn't Echo. Yeah. Because it's... it's not, like, it's a very specific um, description of a character. Like, I feel like it's the most oddly specific character, like, the casting call they've ever done. And it's like, well, it's got to be Echo. Mm -hmm. Like, why would it be anyone but Echo? Right. So it doesn't make sense for it to be anyone else but Echo, so. Yeah. That's oddly specific and hopefully mm. you know if they do cast they can kind of roll other elements into it and really focus on the ronin character and kind of what it what it is the relation to other mm. aspects of the mcu how how clint even got that identity yeah that'd kind of be cool in those flashbacks maybe explain that so mm. i i know actually i i have seen a couple of people say it's for miss marvel and it's like no no, <laughs> it's not Miss Marvel whatsoever. No nope. nationality's wrong. She doesn't know the sign language bit. She doesn't do this, this, that, that. It's 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 not Miss Marvel whatsoever. If that was Miss Marvel, you might as well. I, I don't know. Like honestly, not I'm... do Miss Marvel. Right? Yeah. <laughs> like... you know, if this is Miss Marvel, you have completely you've picked up the like the wrong script. I don't know what you've been yeah. doing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> a... So yeah, more than likely Echo. Um. I'm assuming since Hawkeye's supposed to start, like, what? As soon as they reopen, really? They're going into pre-production, so... I think it's September, something yeah. like that. 
So, hey, they still need to cast a Kate Bishop. <laughs> so uh, we'll see on how that one pans out. Yeah, but. we'll see. But uh, in due time, uh, Echo, it sounds like that's exactly what we're getting.